Okay, well, it's uh, Monday, the 4th of November, and I just made the trek from my village to Addenbrooke's Hospital. Uh, the traffic wasn't bad, uh, but the parking here at this hospital is abysmal, as always. I swept every single disabled bay in the whole place, uh, and they're all taken, as always, and I'm really not in a good mood. I'm really grumpy today. Uh, I had all sorts of emotions. I was really depressed this morning, um, and uh, now I've gone into a lot of anger uh, on the way here because of some stuff that was stirred up, some memories that were stirred up from some of the legal things that are happening, and I'm um, not really pleased. Uh, well, anyway, so uh, I'm going to go here and talk to this guy. Uh, he's on my uh, surgeon's team. He's an ankle and foot specialist. Uh, we're going to see what he's got to say about why my foot is acting like it is. It's kind of caving in on the uh, ankle. And my uh, metatarsals are spreading out a lot uh, down there too. My foot's sort of about maybe a shoe size bigger than it was before. And it hurts a lot when I walk on it. I couldn't even do the calf extensions last week in the gym on it. I had to leave it alone. Uh, it's really making it hard to learn how to walk again, so that's really frustrating. So we're going to see what this guy has to say, and hopefully I come out in a better mood. Yep, so I'm trying to go way past this here block. Now, if I didn't find the spot I did find over there, then I'd have to park there, about a million miles away from where my crippled self needs to get to for my appointment. you think think uh, there'd be something better going on. For people who actually need a hospital like this now here's an interesting observation here here's here's a lady over here she's arguing with this guy in that car and uh, <laughs> blue badge holders are the most ruthless people in the world yeah, myself included uh, everybody flashes them at each other as if <laughs> the other person doesn't have one and then you get into this pissing contest about who needs it more than you do but I try not to get into that. No, I'm gonna get hit by a UPS truck here. So I'm hobbling across the, the road. I just escaped the uh, the Battle of the Bay back there. The Bay for disabled, disabled parking, that is. Uh, it was complete carnage, man. There was canes and all sorts of walking implements flying around and bloodshed. Uh, I'm going to, uh, gonna be working really hard to <laughs> get back in time to see who, whose car actually ended up being there on the spot. Well, now here's the entrance to the main outpatients. I've gone through this door many, many, many times over the last couple of years. Well, I'm here in the waiting room. I spend many days in this place too. Um, it's always the same. They want your name, rank, and serial number, blood type, number of children, their names. Well, <clears throat> anyway, so uh, I'm here now. In all seriousness, the reason I'm here is I need to see uh, what I'm going to do about this leg. This is going to help me make a decision about whether I keep it or whether I try to get it to, uh, mended one more time. Now I'm in the uh, treatment room, waiting to see the doc. I really have a lot of mixed emotions about this. This has been a really tough thing because I, I know that this week some really important decisions are going to be made on a lighter note. Now I've been on the Addenbrooke's diet a few times. Lost a couple of stone. For okay, I'm at x-ray now. I went and had my first encounter with this ankle and foot specialist. And uh, he sent me down here for x-rays. Not not happy at all. And then I get down here to get my x-rays. They want all my details again. 23 February, 66, 16 the hurdles. I've been in the country for more than a year, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Yeah, yep, I'm grumpy. But this is not the way I should be. I should really be trying to uh, put this all in God's hands. Well, I'm not even going to talk about that appointment. That was a waste of time. But uh, look, it looks like that uh, the lady won the fight. Uh, the, the lady with the Mercedes convinced the guy with the Honda to, to move. <laughs> I, I think that's fantastic. Oh, well, I'm going to go. Oh, look. There's about 100 bays open now. Let's imagine that. I think the hospital does this for part of our physio, our rehab. It's got to be, got to be why we'd have to walk so far. It's fantastic. I must be uh, definitely building up my stamina. Hey, there's uh, just one more thing uh, about this, uh, about this place. Uh, 
yeah, the parking's a mess, and uh, the appointment wasn't really that great today. But listen, I really have got to say, uh, I hope I haven't misrepresented Adam Brooks Hospital because they're fantastic. They're great. I, I owe them my life and, and, and my limbs, at least for the moment. <laughs> but yeah, I really do. They, they were great, and uh, I wouldn't have wanted to go anywhere else to have this leg reconstruction done. So, uh, yeah, just fantastic. So that had to go on the record.